Hi, for this video what I want to do is show you how to use a Venn diagram to illustrate. Uh, so for this one what we have is we have the statement A or B, so if it helps you can always write it out. We are looking for A or B and remember that this is the complement. You might also see this um, written, so the CC could also be written in your textbook as C prime or it could be tilde C. So if you see either of those, it would mean the same thing. Just different authors prefer different methods of writing the complement. So remember that anytime you see any one of these three symbols, that says not C. Okay. So for this one, A or B means that it could be in this circle A or it could be in this circle B. Okay. So anywhere in A or anywhere in B. But we want to exclude C from this. So basically what we want to do is we want to exclude this part of it because that is C. We want to be on the outside of that. So what we have is anything in this section here, anything in this section here, or anything in this section over here would be um, fitting the criteria of what we're given. So it's in A or B, but not in C. Some of your text, instead of shading it, might just want you to outline it. So you might have to just outline around it. So if that was the case, you would just outline here and then you would go around this way and this way. So that would be another way of doing it. Instead of filling it in, you could outline the information. Okay, so let's go ahead and try the next one. So the next one is, remember that this symbol is and, so we would have E and not B and C. Okay, so we're looking first with circle A, but we don't want it to be in B. So that would leave everything outside of this area here. So we are eliminating circle B but we want it to be also in C. So we're looking for the overlap of A and C. So A and C overlap here, but we wanna eliminate circle B. So this time we're only talking about this little section right here. Okay, so this is in both A and C, but it's not in B. So it's important to visualize where the information is. Again, your text may have you, instead of filling it in, just outline the area. So we could also just outline this area and say that this area here would contain A and C, but not B. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know. If there are additional topics that you would like me to cover, please let me know that as well.